we got some big breaking news related to Sony's Spider-Man universe, as the previously announced Spider-Man Noir TV series has officially gone its writer. And this man is best known, at least in terms of Marvel and comic books, for writing Punisher. So it has officially been confirmed that Stephen Lightfoot will be writing the upcoming Spider-Man Noir. Now, previously, he was involved with Marvel's Punisher over on Netflix. So this is sort of, in my opinion at least, a sidestep in terms of him writing. Because for those of you that know, Spider-Man Noir is not really the Spider-Man you expect. Like, he's all about actually using guns. And he's way more brutal when it comes to his combat and, well, leaving his enemies just about, I mean, you know, in a hospital, paralyzed. Now, going back to this report, this was confirmed by Variety. And they state that as of right now, there hasn't been any sort of completed script, even with the other writer that they had on board. They're still sort of picking up steam after the writer's strike. And remember, this was announced before the writer's strike. So by all accounts, they're pretty much looking to get this out after Silk. Now, of course, Silk itself is stuck in a weird position over on Amazon. So maybe let's hope that this doesn't suffer the same fate. Or maybe let's hope it does in case that both of these end up being garbage. Although maybe that's jumping the shark, I don't know. Whatever the case is, I'm excited by this. I honestly like The Punisher on Netflix enough. I thought the character was handled way better in the Daredevil series. And specifically when it comes to comparing the versions of Punisher we've had in live action, I think the Netflix one is the most successful. But his standalone series kind of um, lacked, in my opinion, at least the second season. I think the first season was way better overall in terms of what they were going for. Now, again, he's, you know, being brought into this because this is a darker Spider-Man. It is a crime noir, Punisher's crime noir. So you can kind of see the crossover here and sort of like, you know, what they might be going for. I'm genuinely excited. I want to see this. I hope that they could pull out something good. I'm going to obviously have my uh, doubts because it is Sony, but maybe this isn't the Sony overlords keeping tabs on it. We can get some gold.